the Ganyangahaga Nation is recognized as the custodians of these lands and waters. And Shokshagay, or Montreal as we call it, is historically known as a gathering place of many First Nations. We respect the continued connections and the past, present, and future in our ongoing relationships with indigenous and other peoples. Thank you very much. My name is Nigel Sizer. I'm the Executive Director of Preventing Pandemics at the Source. Thank you so much for being with us here today. It's wonderful to see you all and for making it across the street in the snow. Uh, we've got several of our coalition partners here today. We're an organization with 20 partner organizations that make up the coalition. I'd like them to stand up and just give a wave, those that are here, so we can recognize them as well. Lina Diodone, who's on our team, helped organize the whole event. Thank you, Lina K. Wall with I4. Um, we'll have some others coming in as well, I'm sure. But thank you so much for all your partnership. Um, our goal is to increase investment in prevention of pandemics at the store, source, stopping spillover of novel viruses from wildlife into humans. And of course, this is incredibly important because every pandemic going back over 100 years beyond the Spanish flu, and of course many more before that that are not so well understood, were caused by the spillover of viruses from wildlife into humans, either directly or indirectly through our livestock. And almost certainly this includes COVID-19. And so that's why uh, our work is so important, that's why we appreciate the partnership of all of you. We can stop the next pandemic before it starts. I'd like to thank and welcome our co-hosts here today, uh, starting with State Secretary Joachim Flasbach from the German Federal Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development, BNZ, who was going to join us, but he's very busy with the negotiations. And so, of course, we understand that and wish him uh, good luck with that. Uh, but he sends his best wishes. He's very supportive of this work. We work closely with them. We also have with us our partner, Dr. Kim Gurutzmacher, who's the senior advisor on One Health Biodiversity and Health with GIZ Germany. So thank you, Kim, for co-hosting with us. And thank you particularly to GIZ for sponsoring this event and enabling us to actually do this today. And I also want to thank our other co-host, uh, Secretary of State for Ecology, Madame Berger Couillard, uh, from the French Ministry of Ecological Transition and Territorial Cohesion. Thank you so much, State Secretary, for being with us here. Uh, I'm going to now hand over to Kim, who's going to say a few words of welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much, Nigel. Um, dear esteemed colleagues, friends, partners, um, thank you so much uh, to all of you for coming today. So it is with great pleasure that I welcome you to this um, event, this joint event. Um, thanks a lot to Nigel and his team, to Lena for uh, organizing it, for putting so much time and effort into this. So this is a really um, timely event and an important event, so I'm really glad that you could make it here and also welcome to those of you who are online. Um, yes, so I uh, am welcoming you today on behalf of the International Alliance Against Health Risks and Wildlife Trade, um, which is a joint initiative by the uh, German Federal uh, Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development and uh, the uh, Federal Ministry for the Environment, Nature, Conservation, uh, Nuclear Safety and Consumer Protection. And uh, our initiative is being implemented by GIZ, German Cooperation. And uh, the International Alliance is a, a multi-stakeholder platform working jointly addressing the, um, jo the mutual drivers of both um, pandemic emergence as well as biodiversity loss, namely wildlife uh, extraction, trade, consumption, etc. I will uh, go deeper into that on the panel, so um, I will leave it at that for now. And with no further ado, just hand back to Thank Nigel. You, Thank, Thank you. Thank you.